interviewing people today. Fantastic. Yeah, so Fantastic. I would love to interview you. All right, well, here I am. Okay. <laughs> so, my first question is, are you nervous at all because you're nominated and all that stuff? You know, I'm not nervous, I wouldn't say. Um, there's three other great actors in this category, and whoever wins, they're going to deserve it. You know, I, I'm just more excited to be here and support everybody and, and be able to come back for this one last time and, and have a little fun. Yeah, well, I'm sure you'll, you'll do fantastic. Um, so I have a question. I just heard that you were from Austin, Texas. How did you develop the accent? <laughs> well, I was born in Australia. So somehow I think part of me remembers that, but I was only there for six months. And for some reason, the Australian accent was just always the easiest one for me. And uh, I played around with it in the audition room and they liked it, so they kept it. Oh. Yeah. That's interesting. Um, which episode did you submit and why did you choose that one? I don't remember the episode number, but it was sometime back in May. And it was an episode where I start out kind of yelling at Maurice and getting in his face a little bit, which you don't do. It's a big no-no to get in Maurice's face <laughs> on daytime. Um, but I got in his face and then had a moment to myself where I was kind of tired out and got mellowed out a little bit, and then I had a great scene with Lexi. And so that one just had a nice subtle curve to it, and it wasn't a major story. There were no tears. There was just, it was just very real, and, and I thought very a nice personal look at Ethan that you don't really get to see much. Um, and speaking of Lexi, Earlier, you were kind of involved in her abuse storyline. How did it make you personally feel to have to play that kind of confused feeling for being blamed? Yeah, it was it was tough because Ethan was new and everyone had turned against him, and it was kind of art imitating life. Ethan wasn't very well liked when he first came on the show because I, I had broken up this whole dream of Luke and Laura, and he wasn't very well liked. So it was sort of. It was tough because everyone's blaming you for everything and, and you're in trouble and you're in jail and you're getting beat up and, and it was tough. But in the end, you know, being able to play a character that can go through that and suffer through that, it, it was really good for me. That's good. Well, thank you so much for stopping by. Thank you. I'll see you later. All right, sounds good. Bye.